The testimony and evidence in this case has been overwhelming. Outstanding teachers, award-winning school administrators, and the best education policy experts in the country have made it absolutely clear that the plaintiffs in this case are completely wrong. This afternoon, you're going to hear some terrific closing argument from state and CTA CFT attorneys that will summarize it all and really make it clear why the people behind this suit are wrong. What they want to do will hurt California students. So I want to personally thank this great legal team for the work they have done on behalf of California schools and California school kids. You see, the students in this case didn't go out looking for attorneys to represent them. They were sought after by David Welch and his legal team to do this work. These laws, challenged by the plaintiffs, have been in place for decades. And they were. Regardless of the outcome of this trial, though, the struggle is not over. The threat of wealthy corporations seeking to push their political agenda on our students against a strong public school system is very real. It is very real, and it will continue even if the plaintiffs lose this case. Remember, Suits like this and other blame teachers first attacks that deflect attention away from the real issues facing our schools are brought by people who have absolutely no education policy background or expertise. What they do have are deep pockets and a vested interest in the encroachment of the private sector into our public school. They know how to line their own pockets, but they know nothing about what's best for California students. So we're standing up against them. We're standing up for our students and we will continue to do that day in and day out, week in and week out, month in and month out. We will stand up for our students, 